dudes welcome back to the channel hope you're all safe and well I'm back on Borderlands 3 and I just wanted to show you a new cool legendary that you can get temporarily from the um, DLC well I'll call it DLC the event Revenge of the Cartels which is with us until early June and the gun I want to show you is what you can see that I'm using now it's from COV it is an assault rifle called the No Pew Pew and uh, yeah, this thing fires a lot of bullets in a short amount of time. It's got a long time for it actually needs to cool down or before it breaks, so to speak. A cool perk with this, as you can see here, it fires three bullets at a time for the cost of one ammo, which is really cool. Um, this also has a chance to um, spawn a incendiary puddle uh, beneath the corpse of an enemy that you kill with it. Hopefully this dude will have one here. Um, but I'm playing Mayhem Mode 8 and it's just a lot of fun to play with actually it's, As you can see there's the puddle that it drops um, I'm not, never really been a huge fan of COV weapons except for the Linode really But this thing, it's really really cool, it's holding its own in Mayhem Mode 8 I think I did get it drop in Mayhem Mode 8 so obviously The higher the Mayhem Mode you get a chance to get better loot in terms of the damage that they do But this thing does actually do pretty good damage even against shields and armour as well um, Which is quite quite strange actually for a um, incendiary assault rifle but not too bad at all obviously it doesn't melt the armor but as you can see it does kills them quick enough but against the uh, shielded and normal red barred enemies it's really fun it's great to control the areas where there are lots of ads in um, as you can see here it's just easy to use hold down that trigger and you'll be absolutely shredding them um, Really, really good fun and it doesn't take too long to cool it down either so in terms of where you get this weapon from you want to be in the ultraviolet mansion here as you can see and i've had it drop from um the named badasses in, in it i think one of them's called roast it i'll show you a clip at the end of um where i got one of these from because i've had a few of them drop and i think um a mini badass called tender eyes i dropped it as well but you want to be farming the named badass enemies um i'm not sure what mayhem mode you have to be on because I know that certain new weapons in the game, you have to be on at least Mayhem Mode 6, I think. But I'm not sure if that counts for the Revenge of the Cartel exclusive weapons. With it being only a temporary um, event, I'm pretty sure you can be on any sort of game mode. But I've been playing on Mayhem Mode 8 and I've been getting pretty good loot. And that's where I got this from anyway. So let's dive into it. So this is the No Pew Pew from COV. As you can see the stats right there. Uh, it's damage is times three and it only costs one ammo. 108 shots to break, which is pretty good. It will fire faster the longer you hold the trigger as well, similar to like a shredder fire. Uh, it's got some pretty tasty perks on there, 108% weapon damage, etc. I've got an anointed one. Um, if that matters, you could get a bare anointed perk, but that's mine. And it says extra, extra spicy in the red flavor text. You can only get this gun in incendiary form, which I'm happy with. It does its job. It's really cool. Um, and I think with the right build, this could be a really, really good weapon. It's doing the job for me on Mayhem Mode 8, um, and it's just really fun to use, in all honesty. So, hope you managed to get this one before I'm in the name badass enemies in the Ultraviolet Mansion. Hope you found this helpful, dudes. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, guys, and I'll catch you later.